Hey guys, it's Gus, and this will be yet another long, very long, boring video. I It's going to be less than an hour, though. So yesterday, thank you to everybody who joined, I made a gold factory, which is 59 tunes with gold that are making gold. The problem with it, though, is it took nearly three hours to collect all that gold. And it was around 1,800 gold or so. But I have an idea. And I'm going to test it. And I'm going to do it in this video. And um, you can judge for yourself whether it's worth it or not. So the the theory that I'm having is that if you just collect from the workshop and not craft in the workshop on each alt. You know, if there's 12 items in the crate each time, that's 6 gold times, you know, 659 is about 350 gold. If you can get 350 gold each time you invoke... Uh, and it doesn't add too much time to it. That actually may be a very profitable, quick way to make gold. So I'm going to do one invocation cycle normal. And what that will do is give us a baseline of how long it takes to invoke. Now, normally, I never invoke more than once. Uh, because if you want to get the second copper, the second coin for the coppers, you got to invoke the six times. And it takes me about 13 minutes to invoke. And so 13 times 6 is 78 minutes, and I'm just, uh, that's too much time. But if it only takes a few additional minutes to collect all that gold while you're invoking, it can make invoking slash collecting gold very profitable. You know, invoking twice on all your alts is still very profitable. It's just very time consuming. But if both methods, you know, if you can combine collecting from the workshops and invoking, it would just make it way more profitable if it doesn't add too much time so i'm going to do one invoking cycle plain and then i'm going to go back around and do a second invoking cycle while collecting from the work boxes and compare the times now when i collect from the work boxes it's not going to be 12 full items every time uh well it will be but there will be some um gathering stuff because i'm still leveling up uh gathering but i won't be doing that you know, obviously, when they get up to their proper leveling level, uh, gathering levels, uh, there's also it probably takes about a half hour to fill up the workshop crates. I'm guessing maybe an hour. So the other caveat is, if you want to get the max gold, you couldn't invoke back, back to back to back to back to back. You have to wait some time in between. But um, this may be way less tedious than the method we did yesterday. So what I'm going to do is uh, when I go to the character select string screen, I'm going to go ahead and start the timer. I'm going through 58 alts. I'm not including my main because this is just a nightmare inventory, and I don't, I don't want to mess it up by collecting all that stuff. So we'll just do 58 tunes, see how long it takes, and then I'm going to go back through and invoke again and collect from the boxes and then compare the times. All right. So let me go ahead and start the, as soon as I go to character selection screen. And I will start the timer right and started. <clears throat> this, again, this is going to be the most boring video possible. So the pro, ugh, I've already messing up. So I don't have this, um, Obviously, since this is the first time I've done this, it's going to take me a while to do it. Uh, I'm going to misclick a lot. I don't have this uh, repetition down, right? And if you saw, I had the leather helms that time. Uh, thank you, everybody, who pointed that out. Not all, because some of the tunes, I didn't have the um, professions. I probably shouldn't collect the bags because... Oh, wait. Oh, shoot. Okay, I'm doing it wrong this time. I should have done a normal invocation, but I didn't. But that's okay. We'll time this one. We'll just do it backwards. So this one, I'll collect everything. And then the next one, I will just invoke. And then item professions. One, two, three. This is way less painful, though. Oh, did I even collect that time? Poop. That's okay. I went through the process, and that's what we're timing is the process. 
One, two, three. Da -da. So that one I didn't have uh, the leather crafters on that one. As you can see, though, you know um, I have some gathering stuff in there, but it's basically 18 items, which is six gold per. So each one of these is six gold. Oh, and I haven't. That slows it down a tad bit. That's okay. And then item professions. Once you do this for a few days, you'll probably be able to do this in your sleep. But after this, I'm going to do a normal invoking to compare the two times. I meant to do not collecting this time, but that's okay. Just a minor snafu. The, pl the plan, the purpose of the video will still work. Yeah, once you get this down, it will be a um, much smoother process. We're at 2 minutes and 21 seconds. Obviously, I'm messing up a lot. It doesn't look like it wastes a lot of time, but when you multiply a little one-second mistakes times uh, 60, it add, it, those little tiny mistakes add up. <clears throat> and so what you can do, I'm thinking also, is you can sell... Um, obviously, this isn't taking into account the um, selling time. But I think because all my inventories are full or completely empty, I'll be able to just sell like every two days, maybe three, which will save a lot more time compared to ye yesterday's method. Two, three. This is actually going pretty fast. I'm actually very surprised how fast this is going. <clears throat> this this might only add a few minutes to invoking if that's the case watch out the thing is it's going to be faster on the next cycle too because i'm not collecting the vip bag <clears throat> so you're really not even comparing that's adding an additional a little bit of extra time on the first go around uh which will kind of skew the results a tad bit As you can see, the process is going a little faster now. Oh, this isn't bad at all. I'm, holy shit. So I never invoke more than once. I really should invoke twice or all six times because if you, oh, sorry, I shouldn't be talking while I'm doing this. Uh, if you invoke all six times, instead of getting one cold word every six days or so, I'll get a cold word every two to three days. If I invoke twice or all six times, but if it's never really been worth it to me to spend all that time invoking, but, um, if I can get 30, 350 gold doing this each time and you multiply that by six, holy shit. Now you're talking big money. Yeah. We're at 445. This might be less than 20 minutes. Remember, this time, even if I wasn't collecting the boxes, the first time you invoke always takes the longest because you're collecting the VIP bags as well. So the time difference will not be as big uh, as the two times is going to show, the two different times that we're going to get. And the reason why you don't want to sell every day is selling takes time and just summoning the vendor. You know, people say it's only a second or two, but when you multiply that by um, 59, everything just becomes more painful. Holy jeez. So the reason why this won't be 350 gold is because I'm gathering. It's probably closer to 300 gold, but 300 gold while you're invoking. And if it's only a couple minutes more... Oh my goodness, it's, uh, I'll definitely say it's worth it. I'll probably become an invoker twice, a full invoking daily type of person. Which seems, because that would mean less playing, and I really enjoy playing. Holy jeez. This is going really fast. If anybody watched the stream yesterday, I'm sorry. 
<laughs> but if you're watching the stream, you're probably already going, holy jeez. You're probably already thinking what I'm thinking. And the thing is, these boxes will fill up so fast because most of this stuff is 10-minute crafts. And I have three crafters. You can only have three crafters going at once. So every 10 minutes, we'll get three items in there. So if you wait like a half hour, you probably will have... Um, I'll show you when we do our second go around. I'll show you how fast the box fills up. Wow. Oh, actually, it's probably good I'm doing the, the collecting the first time because you have to wait 15 minutes to invoke. So if uh, we would have waited, it, we the first cycle would have been less than 15 minutes if I didn't collect from the boxes. So this is less downtime in the video waiting to invoke again. Holy shit. Oh my gosh. This is going to be disgusting money. This is going to be um this is going to be game changing. Oh my gosh. Because you get a lot of cohorts. If you if you guys want I'll I'll show you how I'll show it for anybody who doesn't know. I got a bunch of coffers. I'll open them up even though it's not a two-time event. Uh, I'll do it just so people can see how fast you can earn cold words from invoking if you have an alt army. Speaking of which, <clears throat> there is a 30% off sale most likely coming uh, during the thing. If you're ever going to buy alts, that is the best time. There's dirt cheap. I think it's 250 uh, zen for two character slots. Uh, at 30% off, that would be 750. That'd be like 175 for two character slots. Oh, forgot to do that, but that's okay. Oh God, just wasting time. Did I collect? Yep. So we have three orders going at once. Unfortunately, that's the most we could have. And if you notice, that just I just wasted like five to ten seconds right there. Again, this is the first time I've ever done this right here. So obviously, I'll be messing up like that right there with input errors because it's not a um, it's not a um, ingrained process in in our in my head yet. Like invoking is like that process. It, you can do that in your sleep now. Ooh boy. I'm already getting excited. I'm already think I'm a believer of this. Really, and it's always it's gonna be faster when you invoke after this because you don't have to worry about those coffers and you don't have to worry about the VIP bags. So the second time you do it, it's always faster. And the third, the the other the other five times you invoke. My goodness, I'm liking this already. We're at nine minutes and thirty eight seconds. just printing money Whew, this might only be like an extra five minutes of invoking to get all this gold my goodness I, I am on a PS5 so you PS4 users a rep this is so much faster obviously not as fast as some pcs but um man this is a uh, this would be extremely painful on a ps4 extremely painful see there was a misclick right there it cost me a couple more seconds it costed your viewing time a couple more seconds apologies Holy shit. This is insane. This is so insane. Now, remember every time I do that, it's an extra six gold. And you multiply that by 59 characters. That's about 350 gold. Goodness. And I think it's only going to be an extra couple minutes to do it from the invoking. Like, my invoking, even if I do this 
do this once a day, I get an extra 350 a day just while invoking. The data is going to be so skewed though because the second time we invoke is going to go so much faster because we're not collecting the VIP bag and we're not collecting the work boxes. But anybody who's thinking about doing this will get a great idea. Yeah, I think I'm going to start invoking six times a day now just off the little bit I'm seeing. If you notice, I'm going a little bit faster than I was when we first started because I didn't have the process down yet wasn't like um, hardwired in my fingers Whew. oh my god anybody any vet who knows about crafting and gold is probably going this is they're probably seeing how much gold this is how fast it is my goodness my goodness oh this is a billion times better than yesterday so the thing is, I'm always going to invoke once a day. So no matter what, dang it. No matter what, this is just an extra 650 gold or 350 gold if I invoke just one time. And it's only adding, like, this will only be minutes. This will be... This will not add that much time. My goodness. This might only be like 17 minutes or so. Oh my gosh. This is a billion times better than yesterday. My God. I was really disappointed yesterday too. I was like, I spent all this time getting these work crap, these workshops for nothing. And now... <laughs> And yes, I haven't sold it. I haven't sold any of it because I have 245 or so bag spaces on all my tunes. Uh, there's a misclick. Another misclick. And selling will take a little bit of time, but selling is so much easier when you have a full bag because you're only summoning the vendor one time instead of twice. So you're saving a little bit more extra time. So right there, you got to be careful and not do it too fast or else it won't register. So you have to pause just a moment when you could collect or I'll ask you if you want to pay the morale twice. Oh, misclick. Now I can do it. Got to have a small pause there. My goodness. Holy jeez. Oh, I'm already a believer. Oh boy. And yesterday when I did the vid, I had that one tune that didn't have the sending stone. Well, it's funny when I went back and changed everybody to the leather that I could. Uh, I had actually completed all the quests. I just didn't go to the uh, quest giver and collect the items. So that was only that was a quick fix. So yesterday after the video, because of everybody's input, I had, um, took everybody back, collected the um, artisans, and I only had leather. I got a lot of leather workers, actually, but I don't have three on each tune. That's why you're seeing um, some bone necklaces in there. And I just used the, uh, the dull, the round knife or whatever they gave you for free and it was like a 98 percent success rate and they'll all be like a hundred percent now after they're leveling up <clears throat> oh boy this is looking good we're at 1540 and obviously um oh boy this is going much faster than i thought it would even though I had done a lot of misclicks and messed up. Oh boy. This is this is this is too good. This is um this is unbelievable. Extra six gold per character in just four minutes. 
five minutes, whatever the time is going to be when we're done with this. So let's say there's a six minute difference. In six minutes, you earn 350 golds. <laughs> that's, if you ask me if that's worth it, that's definitely worth it. Holy shit. 650 gold in six minutes? 650 or 350 gold is, I don't know, 80k, 100, 100k or so? Another misclick, sorry. So let's say it's 60k diamonds. 60k diamonds in six minutes is definitely worth it, in my opinion. We'll see. We'll compare the times. That was a smooth one. Whew. Two more left. So this will be less than 18 minutes. I think. Wow. 1720. Nope. Oh, three more. I'm sorry. It's going to be right around 18 then. Wow, 1745. 1754. 18 minutes. And stop. 1808. 1808. I'm writing this down. 18 minutes, 8 seconds. Now, the next one's going to go fast because, um, A, I'm not collecting the VIP bag, and B, because I'm not collecting from the workshops. So, let's say the next one's 12 minutes, and this one was 18 minutes. So, basically, an extra 6 minutes to get 350 gold. But I imagine tomorrow, when I do this again, it's going to go smoother. So, I think it took 1808, but I think it's probably closer to around 17 and a half minutes because I had so many misclicks and whatnot. But it's been 15 minutes, so it's already ready to invoke again. And then uh, when I get to this last tune, we'll see in the workshop how much stuff is there. So I'm gonna do another invocation cycle and I'll start the clock as soon as I, um, as soon, yep, see that was the last one. I'll start the invocation cycle as soon as I press X on the character like I did this one. So 1808. Wow, I'm very impressed so far. So we're gonna go here and start. Okay, we're at one minute and two, no, two seconds, three seconds. Oh, that's gonna take time. I know players who are so into this that they get all their coppers timed so it will, they'll all come up the exact same day and they don't have that mess up in their flow. Wow, this is insane. This is unreal how good that invoking is with the extra 350 gold. Oh my gosh, this is insane. I'm actually going a little too fast. I got to make sure and not skip a character when I go down the list. My goodness. So if I do start making this my routine, it will be an I'll double the cohorts I get and get tons of gold. Uh this is I'm doing this because um for you, if you're you can see if this is worth your time or not based off how it works for me. This is the first time I've ever done it. So we're all learning at the same time. I do know there's probably a lot of pros who've probably been doing this for years. And they're probably laughing that I'm just now getting to it. Yeah, I got it, buddy. I I know. Holy jeez. I think this is a eureka moment. We're at a minute and 45 seconds now. Oh. 
shoot, it might only be like six minutes. <laughs> I've never, I've never gone through a second invoking cycle before. I always assumed it took as long as the first time. This might be like PC type speed. I don't know. We'll see at the end. I'm very curious. Why have I not been doing this for years? Holy jeez. This is unreal. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Two minutes and 35 seconds. This is, I can't believe I haven't been doing this. I didn't realize it was this fast. I always thought PC six minutes was untouchable. I think that's how long it could be on this. Going at this speed. We're at 252 right now. I'm giggling. This is like a, a eureka moment for me. This is a... Because it takes a lot of work to build the alts. And if you have an alt army and they're not working for you, you wasted your time. And it looks like I haven't been working them as good as I should have. We're at 332. It won't be six minutes, though. I wish it was, but... And all that stuff right there just goes to your inventory and it sells too. What? Oh, because I was going too fast. You know what I'm going to do anyways? Is I'm going to go through the process and just see how long it takes. So I was going too fast at the end there. So I'm going to go like that and I'm going to, because I just want to see how long it takes. So even though we're not collecting, we'll get an idea. So I'm just pausing a little bit. We're at 424. That's my best up, guys. This is um that's my fault for messing that up. But still the time would be the I think it would be exactly the same because we're doing the exact same process. That's why I'm pulling up that screen so that you know I went through the uh, mechanic or button input, however you want to use that term. My goodness. So we're at 450. Yeah, I had not foreseen this because I knew it would be 15 minutes, but since it took 18 minutes to do it, I didn't think we'd get through it. Uh, that's probably because I got faster as I learned the, the mechanic, learned it. Oh my gosh. Sorry, it's not 100% scientific because I'm doing this, but um, we can't stop now. This is too good. We're almost done. We're at 535 right now, by the way. Shit, I'm wondering if it's going to be like seven minutes to invoke. I don't know. We'll see. I don't know how far I am down here. No, nah, I probably won't. Oh, we're at 6.05. I was really hoping to be around six minutes. Be close to the uh, be close to the PC time. Yeah, I I know a few people who can invoke on fifty four tunes in six minutes on PC. Oh, that would be amazing if we could do that on PS four or, or Xbox. I don't know how Xbox works on invoking. I'm actually going a little bit slower waiting to make sure that mechanic pops up because I don't want to skew the time too much. So we're at 6.53.
Remember, I'm doing the second round so I can compare the time with the first round. And I didn't realize the time would catch up. So I messed up there, but as I'm going through the process, it should make the time somewhat okay. Not 100% scientific, but it'll be fairly accurate. Now, when I did this before, way back when I got the PS5, it was right under 13 minutes. But I was collecting the VIP bags as well. So just invoking is when you don't include the VIP bag, it speeds up the time a lot. I didn't realize that because I've never done it. So we're at 740 right now. It's going to be under 10 minutes, I think, though. Oh, this is this is unbelievable. This is a Eureka moment for me. Hopefully it inspires some people to start setting up a farm as well. Or a factory, the gold factory. Oh my goodness. This is unbelievable. I just didn't know invoking was this fast because I'd never done it without the, I've never went past the first cycle before. We're at 827. Oh yeah, we're going to be under 9.30. We're at 8.55 right now. Nine oh two. I'm getting ready to do the stopwatch. And nine sixteen. So the invoking with the VIP bags and collecting the three hundred and fifty gold was eighteen oh eight. Invoking without the VIP bag and without collecting was 916. So it's a difference of just under nine minutes. So if we take away the VIP bag, it probably would go from 1808 probably down to, I'm guessing, 17 minutes. So, or even 716. So for eight minutes extra, you're getting about 350 gold. I think that's worth it. Actually, I really think that's worth it. Because if you time it right now, if you do them like two hours apart, the bag will be full. So every time you do it, you'll get, um, you see these three are being made, but this one's got eight minutes left, one minute left, 28 minutes left. So if you wait, this will be almost full. So if you could wait when it was always full <clears throat> and get 350 gold each time, but that would be... I don't think that's reasonable for everybody. So even if you collect twice throughout the day, uh, during two invoking, that's that would add, you'd get, if you did that twice in a day, you get an extra 700 gold for an extra nine min, uh, eight, 18 minutes. 900 gold for 18 minutes, as opposed to yesterday, where it's 1,800 gold in two hours and 45 minutes. Yeah, this is, I'm convinced, guys, 100% I'm convinced. Uh, and just just in case you're new to the game, I, I got some, here we go. I got 250, what a great number. And you should do this during a two-time event, but I'm going to do it for you guys. 250, right? It's about a 3.5% chance of cohorts. So with these, we should get about eight cohorts. Ready? And I know I'm dumb for not waiting because the, uh, rank five enchanting stones drop double so instead of having two right now we'd have four uh always you could always get more cohorts oh there's one or you could always get less depending on rng oh, we've gone we're at 150 so we've gone through 100 already and we've gotten four cohorts uh but this would double it because i've never done full invoking five cohorts uh five cohorts Six cohorts. We got 70 more left. 
seven coal wards. We got 40 left. And we're at six, seven. Okay, seven coal wards. We didn't get that eight in the last 50, but we got 13 of these. We would have got double, so we would have gotten 13 more times 23,000. So 13 times 23. So I did lose 299,000 by not um, waiting to the tooth come event, but I wanted to show it just for anybody watching. Instead of having seven, we would have around 14 because we'd have double cohorts. So yeah, my new strategy now in this game is to invoke twice a day or invoke all six times. And I'm going to collect from the workshop at least twice, the first one and last one, and probably in the middle. So if I collect in the middle and the last and the first and they're full each time, if they're full, that will be an extra 1,300 gold a day for an extra seven, eight. So 24 minutes for um, 350, for 1,200 gold for an extra 24 minutes. That's a no-brainer. Plus, I'm going to force myself to invoke to get these double cohorts. Yeah, this is... um. If you're not a believer, uh, comment below of why this wouldn't be a good use of time. Uh, yeah, I know. Uh, playing's more fun. But compared to yesterday, this is, I think, way more better use of time than what we were doing yesterday. And I'm very, very impressed with this result. Very pleased. Um, can't wait to hear what you have to say. Stay classy, never winner. See you soon.